Hey there, welcome back to Voltage Productions. My name is Fulton, and here's episode 1 of my Super Flat Survival World. So, I'm gonna actually modify it just a bit. So, you're wondering, Fulton, what do you mean by that? Well, usually, you see people going on the classic flat for Super Flat Worlds. However, you see, I'm not gonna do that. I'm gonna make this a bit more interesting. You see, Fistner, Mog Squad? Well, uh, he created his world with just a classic flat, unedited, in like 2013, I think. Maybe 2012? I don't know. It's very old. Just watch his channel. Anyway, as you can probably tell, it's, uh, it doesn't even have any natural stone. And I don't like cobblestone generators. So, so, bada bing, bada boom. So, what this does, it basically just makes it kind of like an old Minecraft world. But it does do things differently. Hey, Editor Revolts in here. Just wanted to let y'all know that I did a little bit of rambling after this, wondering what to call it, and I decided on Modern Flat. As I consider it basically just an upgraded version of the normal Classic Flat. So now we also have Classic Flat and Modern Flat. I think it makes sense. I'll leave the order for all this in the description if you want to use it too. Alright, that's all from me. Back to uh, recording, Bolton. Okay, right off the bat. Alright, nice. Let's on, actually. Okay, I just reloaded the game, and now have some mods installed. You might be wondering, Volton, which ones have you enabled? Ah, don't worry about it, it's probably fine. Again, okay, if you're wondering why I decided to enable the minimap, well, first of all, I'm not going to be using F3 in this world at all, so it basically means I have to use over my this turn to find out what direction I'm facing. Rare. Okay, I'll consider sparing it for now. You didn't even give me string. Does my tree tree want to work here? Or, what the f? I kinda have to kill it. Get over here. You shall not disobey me! There, finally. Okay, if you wonder why I just murdered an innocent cat, there is actually a reason behind it, believe it or not. It has to do with my- what, what, I'm a capitalist, what do you expect? Oh, hello there, good sir. You're quite handsome today. Don't like using handsome. So yeah, nah, none of that. Anyway, iron sword. This is necessary. Okay, you have intro part. I feel like a lot of you can see where this is going. Hello, villagers. You all look very nice today. That's probably the only compliment you'll ever get from me. So, we can end on aforementioned scrap video. I actually need my stream duper underground. If what I understand, the thing needs to be facing south, so I may as well dig underground. Okay, then that's probably my problem. Hope oh, I'll figure it out in the morning. Okay, so uh, I got rid of them. Don't know how I did it. I changed difficulty to peaceful. 
listen, if it's an option and I can do it, then, uh, you know, I'm gonna do it, man, you know? Okay. What the fuck is that? Okay, anyway, I just need to continue carving. Water for this. And some drop doors. And also a leather. Let me see if I can make this a uh, farm for <laughs> Yeah, no, okay. Boom. Okay, we have a good thing here now. That's cool. Ooh, hello there, good sir. You're looking quite handsome today. Is that your life there? Thank you. Uh, I think I did this wrong. Okay, if we're gonna get to work, turns out we only put more time for that Or at least, I'm just gonna leave it on just in case. No, I don't really have much reason for it. I mean, what are you doing? What the fuck do you do this much strength? Oh my god, that's a lot of mobs. Up. Oh my god. Okay, let's just. Why are you going down? Anyway, so, uh, yeah, we need to destroy all of the buildings here. Let me just get my axe out. Uh, let's hope someone... Oh, okay, let's get that. We have fishermen now. Maybe it's a team. A few inches later. Okay, this might be the earliest I've ever gotten a piece of diamond armor. Anyway, let's see. So, I love you. Excuse me, sir. decided to just skip all of it, since most of it's basically the same thing. I'm trying to get resources, so I can go to another, ah. and also level up these damn villagers. I'm just to spend all my time leveling ah. up the toolsmith. As you can see, he is now selling me diamond axes, ah. and he's also giving me diamond pickaxes as well. Yep, leveling up those guys takes a while, so I'm glad I was able to do it. You know, this is actually, like, I don't know if you guys noticed about me, but I usually take really long to complete the game, so this is actually really fast for me. 
So yeah, I still have the level of this douchebag. Noticing something. But I don't know if you guys noticed it, actually. Look left and right. Do you see any slimes? Well, you must be hallucinating because I sure as hell don't. Maybe that's just because the normal Y level on, on this world is Y59 and not 60, like in pre 1.18 flat worlds, or negative 60 like modern flat worlds. I don't know. Yeah. Well, good so I can always fall back on this village if the four villagers I have in my home village are still being pieces of shit. Your prices, okay, yeah, they have gone down. Perfect. Perfect. And finally, ooh, spike three, too. Perfect. Nice. So earlier, I was raiding villages, and I grabbed this lecture. You may be wondering, Volton, why'd you record it? Because I was mainly out there looking for obsidian. Which is why I have six of saying in my inventory now. I'm gonna have to go back out there for more blacksmiths later. But you know whatever it's called mine. Hey, where's that jobless guy? Oh here he is, he looks just like you, the viewer. He says shh. A few inches later. So, uh, huh? as you can see, I finally have mending. I need not advance the statistics. Items broken. 88 lecterns huh. broken. That took much longer than it should have, and it's not even at a very good exchange rate, but you know what? Honestly, I can't be bothered to do anymore, so I'll take it. Hi, Editor Bolton here. So, I'm just going to say it. After a bit of this, I went back to looking for lava. This time I decided to try searching to the north and not the south, and pretty quickly I found some lava. After that, after a bit of trying, I was able to open my Never portal, and I did a lot of Never ex exploration. I was going to try and beat the dragon, but, uh, yeah, there's no problem with that. This is a custom preset, and for some reason, on this custom preset, the Ender Dragon did not spawn. And by that, I mean no stronghold. So basically, I can't really beat the game properly. So it kind of leads me to the question, would you guys be totally opposed to me just spawning in my own stronghold? Like, I can't spawn one in myself, so I don't know if you guys would be okay with me doing that. Okay. Yeah, I'll go back to the live recording now. 
So here's an update. As you can see, as long as I mean, I just slept anyway. So uh, I looked in Mox Mom's Discord server, and there are stronghold coordinates pasted in there because apparently every flat world has the exact same stronghold coordinates. And if I'm remembering correctly, so yeah, what I'm gonna try to do is go to those stronghold coordinates and see if one did spawn, but it's just not working for some reason. I'm just gonna say, guys, I don't think the uh, never portal, not never portal, sorry, the end portal is here. So that basically means these eyes vendor I have here are completely worthless, which sucks. But whatever. Hi, it's uh, Fulton again. So yeah, as you can see. Can't really see it, but it's now next day, and so we're gonna continue building the base. Or I guess, sorry, well, no, not really. I can't speak. I literally, I'm my mind's not really able to collect it. But anyway, I left this out of the uh, video, but I re-enchanted everything. This axe is now really good. And you know what? We need to get another librarian. This time, I want to get like a silk touch pickaxe. So yeah, that means we're gonna have to do a lot of profiting. Pleasure doing business with you. I hate you. Yeah, it's not so fucking fun to be imprisoned, is it? So touch! Huh? Finally! Huh? Bending. Are you two 
beginning. Yeah. Oh. Well, I don't really care to check, so... A few inches later... Okay, I'll take it, I'll take it. Uh, anyway, I'm gonna give my pickaxes some points. Okay, everyone, I'd like to introduce you all to the Canadian Moneymaker and... And... Silky, like you. Okay, I've got a few stacks of stone now, it's not enough at all, but... Actually, is it? Actually, hell no. But for now, I'm just gonna look for a good place to build this. Oh, I think, actually, up here, I think, would actually probably be better. Kind of where, where a lot of this stuff is. See, it's like, actually, a pretty good place to build for now. Yeah, I think up here is pretty good. I think maybe just make this, like, caramel out of a stack. Yeah, it's actually a bit bigger than I was expecting. Yeah, that's good. Let's go with it. I think maybe this I'll build out like 14 blocks because then like add with this wall and then another one that'll make it 16, so. Here. You know what? Yeah, yeah, I only used like three stacks here. Like, not even a three stack, I still have several blocks left over, but you know what? It's fine. Okay, anyway, the next thing I need to do is use the Canadian Moneymaker and go down to a Deep Slate level. Because, again, there's Deep Slate in this world. Okay, so I think count to... Oh, wait! Ooh, Wandering Trader! Perfect! Let's see what you got. Please have something good. I want to kill you. 13, 14. Okay, that's good. Fob player does.
Master. Okay, I think you know, having these walls go up like six high. I want the roof to be open, kind of, so. Okay, let's do that. One, two, Got some frames going up here. Okay, so what I'm thinking is to add a little bit more color to this, I might just get some color from different people there. We're gonna get a tiny bit more in a bit. Uh, honestly, out of all these, I'm not sure which one's the best. I think I'm leaning more towards. Like, the white glass? Yeah, I think we're gonna go with the white glass. I was thinking of originally partitioning all of this into rooms, but I'm honestly, I'm looking at this now, I think this might be better if, like, I only have, like, three rooms, like, this big one in the middle, then two ones on the side. I think that might actually be better for the design. Oh shit. I think I might need just a whole stack of balls here. Yeah. 
Yeah, I need more deep sleep. Editor Volton here, so yeah, I'm just gonna say it. I'm I'm not gonna sift through like 40 minutes of footage, which is mostly the same thing. So I'm just gonna cut to when the outside itself is done, and I'm just focusing on the interior. I don't think I need much more deep slate at all for that to be on the roof. He'll throw in just a tiny bit more just to be safe. <laughs> you know what? Just make sure nobody spawns on the quote unquote roof. I'm just gonna. First, I'm gonna just slab it up. Oh, wait, is that literally perfect? Oh, nice! Okay, that, that's good, actually. Okay, let's real quick come down here and see what we got. Okay, I'll take it. Could be better, but you know what? Whatever, it's fine. Okay, anyway, the next thing I want to do, actually, before I start moving in, is literally just build a fence around here. A fence, because I think that would add some nice contrast to the very dark build. Hold on one sec, I'm just gonna... Think. Yeah, I think it just need, needs to be those blocks that I need to remove there. There we go, no villagers are growing in. Good moving in. Real quick, I just need to stop by this dude over here. Hold on, sir. Okay, I'm thinking this is going to be my new bedroom. I also need a burn bedroom for the rest of the series. The center here. Hmm. I want to have an enchanting table, but the thing is. Uh, yeah, I don't think I can. Okay, I think we just move the uh, sub over here in the corner. And yep, okay, that's good. Oh, uh, hello, people. What was that? You, you don't like your table being broken? I don't care. Okay, I've made a bunch of chests now. And I think we're gonna do with them in here. Just place them all down in this room. Okay, now. So yeah, here we go. It's basically done. Actually, we need to start moving stuff over. So this chest here, I think, will just be all for all the stone blocks. This one, for just a ton of deep sleep. First night in the new crib, let's go! I think the last thing I'm gonna do for the house in this video is literally just gonna be to uh, 
decorate the top here. Yeah, I think so, right? Let's just get that in there, and... Done! Okay! Well then, you guys, I think it's a good place to leave off, so if you enjoyed this video, please leave a like, uh, I don't know, smash subscribe or something, like how you'd smash your girl, or your guy, depending on what your gender is, or sexuality. And yeah, I might be back with another episode sometime soon if you guys enjoyed this. For now, though, that'll be all from me. Goodbye.